Evening everybody, Saturday the 20th of, or, evening everybody, Saturday the 20th of October and I'm home. Um, first word problems, post hospital blues, like, I don't know, when I'm in hospital I just want to get away from everybody. And then you come back and you've been surrounded by like 30 people 24-7 for a week and then you get home and I'm all on my own all day be a bit lonely it's nice to begin with but then you don't realize like how kind of unwell you still are like I'm I'm not 100% better from like my last PMDD episode I'm completely safe and I would not do anything but um it's just like there's still like a few random negative thoughts there um and you have like I have still have a few low moments throughout the day um and also, the other thing is tiredness. Oh my days. Tiredness. I am so tired. I don't think I woke up until like 10am. And then I've just woken up from like another three hour nap. Oops. But I know like things will get better and um, as the days go on. And somebody was saying to me you know like oh you're so strong I don't know how you cope with it and all this and I said to the nurses as I left like honestly like if I thought about the fact that in less than two weeks I were back in hospital I don't think I could cope I honestly don't think I would be able to cope with it it would overwhelm me and so I said I just take it a day at a time like one day at a time and take each and every day as it comes because if I did think about it and think you know, in less than two weeks, I've got to go through this whole thing again, time and time over again until about February, March at the earliest next year. I honestly, I just couldn't do it. Like, it would just completely overwhelm me. And I just think I can't, I can't do it. I can only live a day at a time because I just take, take, like I said, I take it as it comes and just deal with what, each day throws me and I really do feel the Zolodex is completely ineffective at the moment and I'm back to how I was pre-diagnosis the only difference being like at least now I'm a lot kinder and compassionate to myself and I'm like yep yeah, this is PMDD I am knackered because of PMDD and you know there's a light at the end of the tunnel now but yeah that's what I've got to say I'm tired and it's my first day out of hospital and as much as I don't want to be in hospital, the first couple of days out of hospital are always quite difficult because I don't always think I'm... Well, I'm not 100% well when I come out, basically. I'm well enough to come out and I don't want to be there any longer than I need to be, but I'm not 100% myself. And so you go from all this support to no support and it can be a little bit of a shock to the system, but I'm happy to be home.